Welcome back to my channel. I am Cat Woods. I'm going to do a review over this Encourage devotional Bible. I'd like to thank Holman and Lifeway for making this review possible. They sent me this Bible so I can go ahead and share it and you guys get you excited and knowing what this amazing Bible is all about. So I have had it for a couple of days. Here is the IBM number. And I made sure to go ahead and mark out a few pages that I want to share with you all. So let me go ahead and remove the dust cover. I do, I like the blank canvas, but I don't. So I'll give you why I like it. You can personalize it to yourself. We all have different personalities. So it's not like, um, you know, we are just stuck with the one we can add embellishments, add stickers, decorate it to where we personalize it to ourselves. They have this beautiful silver encouraged and on the spine. So we have the CSB translation, encouraged devotional Bible, Christian standard, and then the Holman Logan or logo down here. It is a cloth cover and hardback so the inside both the front and the back will have this printed paper it is a paste down so you can also decorate the um, inside cover as well as the front so it's like a blank canvas you guys this will be an amazing Bible to start growing your Bible gardens so we have a beautiful presentation page with this Bible belongs to love that we have my commitment so I love how it's at the beginning of the Bible so every time we open up the Bible we are reminded of the commitment that we've taken for our journey through this Bible and then we can also write down names and um, other people that are helping us you know hold up our commitment so I love that. And then right through here, this one is probably my favorite. This is women that will help you dive deeper into the Bible as we're planting our seeds and ha having our garden grow in this Bible. We can put down the women that have helped us through prayer, helped us um, just really stay focused on what our purpose is with you know spreading the word of God so we could put down like sisters creative journey through the word with Cat Woods if you're a member in my Facebook Facebook group put down the day that you joined maybe a little note of a sister that had helped you through prayer maybe a dark time um, maybe you just made some really really good friends and you just want to keep track of that it's right here at the beginning of the Bible and what is amazing is it's special because it's in your Bible I love that so we have these 3D looking images. So beautiful. That's why I'm saying like garden because they have so many beautiful and these little flowers and stuff just like you would like in your journal or something how you press your flowers. They have them all throughout the Bible. So just it's perfect growing your garden through here. Here's the copyright page. And the other available options for this Bible. We have the table of contents. A letter from the editor and how to read. So here we have how to read the Bible, how to set yourself up for success, reflect and response. So for those of you who have, you know, you're new to the faith and you'll like just guidance, um, this Bible has lovely suggestions. So God's story of redemption. Now here are the key features we're going to find throughout this whole Bible. We have themes, so like devotional themes, or I'm looking through the screen. Yeah, they're devotional themes. 
Now these little, I'm going to call them washi samples, and we'll get to, you know, later on, what they're really about. We have 10 reading plans, and there is, I do believe, 300 and, yeah, 312 devotionals that are like this. We have Women of Courage Little Boxes throughout the whole Bible, 66 book introductions, and each one will have a different little flower, so they're all not like the same pattern. Each one would be different. And then theme verses that they pulled, and they decorated it all. Oh, wait until you see it. But this right here is my favorite about this whole, um, like key point about this whole Bible. I love the journaling space in it. So here are the themes for those little washi samples. And it's really focused on women. So gentlemen, Christmas is coming up. You have sisters, mothers, aunts, and nieces that will love, love this Bible. information into the Christian standard always suggest reading that translation okay so this is look at those pictures I just get so excited I want to share you share these pictures with you oh my phone there it's so realistic looking okay so this is the first introduction how to understand the author's heart connecting with God's story and connecting with our story. And at the bottom, they will show you um, each theme that is, you know, the devotionals and their themes throughout each book. So each book will have a different devotional, different themes that they focus on. So I love that. It is a two column Bible. They have these light teal green though, that matches the cover chapter and headers we got footnotes and then look at the lines so these lines are light enough to where if you still want to maybe doodle instead of just write something you just want to doodle down something you can still draw over it and they're not like really black black bold lines that you can still like it's distracting so I'm excited to share more about what I'm talking about in this Bible Here is one of those devotionals. Here's a two-page one. Now they're not all two, you know, full two pages like this. Some of them are just one. But do you see how there is a washi color? I'm just calling it washi, but there's a washi color. Don't worry about going to the front of the Bible to remember what theme this was over. They each have it right here at the bottom. And then it takes you to where the next devotional plan is. So that is, I love that. It's kind of tedious having to bounce back and forth. There's one of those courageous woman boxes. Okay, so let's get on through. And at the end of each book, you guys, we get a full page of lines. So we can write down a prayer over that um, book that we just read. Maybe we want to add some extra notes. We can always come to the back of the book, add them here. You can do some calligraphy, um, you know, just hand lettering. You can add a picture here. You, this is so open to doing whatever you want in your garden. It is exciting. This is like a journaling Bible for maybe an older person who doesn't want like the Inspire Bible, which has digital images to color. You just, you maybe want to focus on a verse and you want to write about it. This is a perfect Bible for that. To keep all your study notes in this Bible and not have to worry about messing up maybe another Bible. So this is made to be written in. I love that about this. See, this is another introduction that has a different, um, you know, it's different flowers and stuff. Another one of those encourage boxes. So look, look at the color look at the written richness of the color really so imagine and I'm always encouraging you guys to read your Bibles front to back you're reading 
um, maybe you're starting to get a little bit bogged down and then bam one of these lovely quotes which is a verse one of these lovely verses pop out at you maybe you can um, journal maybe a note through here inspired from this picture so I love it and I love how the just rich the color is picture sitting at a coffee shop and you you know someone's gonna walk up to you because it catches their eye they're gonna want to know what Bible you're in oh yeah there is white and green satin ribbons it is a glued paste I kind of wish it was a sewn like a Smith sewn so it doesn't you know it's sturdier that is my only flaw with this Bible that it is it's only a glued so that's how it repeats throughout the whole Bible every page you will have journaling so you don't have to worry about am I gonna run out of journaling spaces picture filling this up and a couple of years from now you can either pass it down to your kids or just watch your own growth you're watching your garden grow you're watching yourself grow spiritually because you've had kept your notes your reflections your prayers through certain verses it's this is definitely this is definitely a Bible you guys it is it's an exciting Bible look at this again the print work the detail work can two walk together with a green to meet it's so beautiful I love it I really I'm excited about this Bible and I know like a lot of pages are sticking oh look at this one I don't know why this Bible isn't talked about more I, I really don't I mean it is a new Bible that just came out but so you help me help me spread the good news about this Bible it's perfect for a group because we could all just you know share it what we're writing what we pulled from a verse look at this they're just they're exciting it's just a whole wow moment it's like having your own little Pinterest board inside your Bible Now there is no red lettering. Go on. I don't want to show you too many of these. I want to give all the goodies away. I'll show you one more. Look at that one. So exciting. I love it. Okay, so this does have reading plans in the back. There is 10 reading plans and each of them have a theme worth a theme that they're focused on and a different amount of weeks for each theme and again they're all based on women so what women are going through um, meeting the women throughout that book of the Bible see this is a seven week this is a six week the other one was a five And this is the index so all those little um, boxes that we've seen with women of courage this is how we can find it in the page numbers along with their themes and the tropical index and then there are no maps it comes to the end so super super excited about um, about this Bible for a lot of reasons like I said you could personalize it to you we all journal different we all are inspired differently so having so many options open to this Bible but there are so many options in there to keep you focused I love that I love it about this Bible so make sure to hit that like button if you appreciate and are excited about this Bible let's get it shared out there um, and again, I want to thank I want to thank you. Make sure you check out the link. I will um, have a link for you to buy this Bible. And okay, I'm gonna cut it off there. Remember, be a creative tool in our Father's art box today. And I'll talk to you all later. Bye.